out here on Call of the Wild with intent to hunt some Roosevelt elk today. Spend some time out here on Layton. This is the coder bow with my personal customization added to it. This is the Verhunga dark green paint, as well as the Layton Lake wood bark camo. After five, I've been up here already. I did blow out that zone. On uh, <laughs> I think we're gonna get down to the river and we're gonna head south. That way, we're not bothering these zones up here. We're gonna see what we can find. As I walk, oh, did get a call from a bull down here, which is good. But I do have <coughs> not, I'm not clicking, it's just my mouse keeps thinking that I am. I was in. Yes. I believe I have. Increased chance of eliciting a vocalization response from nearby animals when using collars. I personally think that that perk for my style of hunting is very, very helpful. I do tend to just walk around and call just to get an idea of where animals are. Very helpful to have the perk that makes them more likely to call back at you. A little further inland than I'd like to be, but I suppose if the elk are here, no problem with it. to hang out and hide out. I want him to come to me since I'm carrying a bow. find this bull very shortly. Oh, there he is. One huge benefit to using the bow is the penetration is incredible and they do not move very far. It just goes all the way through most animals. But, not bad. A little shy of gold, but he was a level 3. Mm -hmm. 
just keep moving. I think another great benefit to using the bow is the hunting pressure is much lighter. Much, much lighter. These have a more obvious purple tint to them. This one's more of a gray. I think I'd have to do it like an actual experiment for the scientific purposes of it, but I think it's like two bow shots or three is equivalent to one gunshot with hunting pressure, but I could definitely be wrong. also be part of the previous herd. This way, I dare you. I missed. It was it was worth the shot though. <clears throat> Tried to shoot. I got it. Oh, I hit the I hit the bush. All right. Let's see if I can pick that arrow back up. Oh, nope, it broke. It broke. Uh, you can on occasion pick them back up. It just depends, I believe, on if you have the perk. That's at least one down for sure. I think we hit the second one in the face. I don't know if he would go down from that. I'm sure if we just kept an eye on it, we would know. This one, I think, will have gone down. Just not sure which one it was. But we'll keep tracking. We'll see what's going on. Oh, there it is. I'm still gonna stay just walking. I am gonna crouch. I'm not sure if the other herd will be working its way back towards me yet. I suppose it's not really another herd, it's his herd. But all the same, I'm gonna have to try and stay a little bit quiet as I head up here. Ah. We were a little far back as he was moving on that shot. He would have been. Points over gold ish. Not bad. Not bad. We only actually moved about 750 meters, but. Quite the trek. Almost over with elf drink time. They stop at 8. It is 7.30. I have been chasing him for almost four hours in game time. Not 
not you. It might be you, though. It's neither of you. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, oh! Well, you're not the one I shot first. But... Damn. <laughs> huh. I'm just gonna hope that that last call that we heard was another mating call and he doesn't actually... He's not spooked. Although he probably is. It's hard to say though since it is the bow. for the bear though. Dog is laying down, behaving. Better view while standing. Oh my goodness. Just coming right in. Waste no time. It's a skull. Oh, if you're gonna do that though. Uh-huh. Perfect. Love a good drop shot, especially on a predator. Oh yeah, and that's just what I mean by the bow has the absolute greatest penetration. Good bow hunt, a good bear hunt. And even just hunting bees, we've already pulled the pressure off from earlier. Haven't erased the rifle pressure, but we've already erased the bow pressure. We'll go here, we'll change time, we'll see if there's anything at the lake.
has no idea. That was a bad shot. Oh, you can see it. Well, at least we're hopefully gonna get the mail, because I have a lot more patience waiting for him. Factored in the wind because that's a lot more of a crosswind than I had with the elk. That's probably what did it. Since my dog is out in front of me, do you think the barrel go aggressive at my dog? So with my dog. Check that I have the correct info. I don't know really if this guy just walked away from me. Got it. And he's already down. Three bears this hunt. Just in case. Spray the deodorant. Wear your deodorant, kids. I know they're getting close when you hear them. Oh. You can tell my dog is there. I got you well. Ready. There, number one. Well, I suppose technically number two. in her face. Oh, you poor thing. That, that's a bad shot. Yep. Also, I love that it's still in her face even though it went through to her leg. I'm sorry. Alright, let's go pick this guy up and I think we'll call it a day because I have a nice have... screenshot. Ooh, 
we were a little low. But not too bad. Not bad at all. What is their speech? 100%. Alright, cool. Good to know. His tail's kind of in the wall. Not bad. I like it. Let's put the raccoon here, because ideally I'll get some of the other special colors. Well, that's cute. We'll leave it there. I appreciate you all for hanging out with me today. It's been very, very fun. I will see you next time. Bye!